Hey and welcome back to the revolution and some more WWE 2K19 news as early today Lana and Ruth have hosted the third and final part of this year's roster reveal with a focus this time being on WWE legends and Hall of Famers. Unlike previous weeks, this week's roster reveal only featured a handful of women with seven female superstars confirmed for this year's game. So which female superstars made the cut in the final part of this year's roster reveal? Let's find out. First up, Alundra Blaze, Beth Phoenix, Ivory, Jacqueline, Lita, Stephanie McMahon, and Trish Stratus. Unless there are any surprise entrants to this year's game, that brings a total on disc roster for this year's women's division to a record breaking 13 women. This, of course, doesn't include manager models for the likes of Stephanie McMahon and Zelina Vega or any other surprise female managers in this year's game. If Nikki Cross is indeed part of this year's game, that would bring the total female superstars to 39, with last year's game hosting 32 female superstars, which included DLC content. As part of the roster reveal, we also got another sneak peek look at Trish Stratus in this year's game after Trish was briefly spotted during the breakdown of 2K's newest mod, 2K Towers. At the time, it was speculated that Trish's model was nothing more than a placeholder image after Trish Stratus was once again seen spotting her infamous jumpsuit. However, in this year's game, it seems so 2K have finally decided to give Trish that long-awaited update as she is now seen to be spotting her WrestleMania 19 attire as part of her triple threat match against Victoria and Jazz. I have to say, I'm so glad to see the back of that jumpsuit and I was pretty taken aback to see that 2K have finally decided to switch things up. Now that doesn't mean that the jumpsuit isn't in this year's game and it could either be an alternate attire for Trish as part of the unlockable aspects of the 2K Towers or it could simply still be in the community creation section. Regardless, I've won, I'm super happy to finally have a different version of Trish to play with and who knows, maybe we'll get an alternate or different attires for the likes of Lita, Ivory and Jacqueline who are so long overdue updates. So that's our breakdown of this year's WWE 2K19 women's roster and I have to say I am super duper excited with what we have to play with. Of course there are some omissions with the likes of Nikki Cross, Maria Kanellis and possibly Dakota Kai but we still don't know what the future holds when it comes to DLC content. This year's game has the largest and most up to date women's roster, of course discluding Nikki Cross and it's something that should certainly be celebrated instead of focusing on the small details. Even if we only have two DLC female superstars, that brings it to a whopping 40 female superstars, which is bloody amazing. But that's enough about what I think of this year's women's roster, and I want to know what you make of today's roster reveal, as well as Trish Stratus' brand new model. Let us know in the comments below which female superstar you are most looking forward to playing as, as well as which female you'll be playing as first. Be sure to stay tuned to The Revolution for all the latest women's roster news, footage and so much more.